टुडे वी वॉन्ट टू डिस्कस अबाउट सिग्मा एल्जेबरा सिग्मा एल्जेबरा इज वन ऑफ द इम्पॉर्टेंट टूल्स इन मेजार थ्योरी टू डिस्कस डेफिनेशन ऑफ सिग्मा एल्जेबरा लेट एक्स बी आ नॉन एम टी सेट एंड ए बी द फैमिली और कलेक्शंस ऑफ और कलेक्शंस ऑफ सबसेट्स ऑफ एक्स वी से दैट द कलेक्शन ऑफ सबसेट्स ऑफ एक्स इज सिग्मा एल्जेब्रा इफ इट सेटिस्फाइज द फॉलोइंग प्रोपर्टीज द प्रोपर्टीज आर नंबर वन फाइव बिलोंग्स टू द कलेक्शन ऑफ ए नंबर टू फॉर एवरी सबसेट ए belongs to a we have x minus a belongs to the collection a number 3 for every sequence a n n is equal to 1 to infinity of elements of the collections of subsets of x which is a we have n is equal to 1 to infinity an belongs to a the pair x comma a is called a measurable space and the sets in a are called measurable set few properties of sigma algebra we want to discuss which is a obviously hold number 1 x belongs to phi because the we use the property 1 phi belongs to a then its complement x minus phi belongs to a hence x belongs to the collection a number 2 for a free a comma belongs to the collection a we have a union b belongs to the collection a obviously from this three properties above the section b belongs to a a minus b belongs to a all the properties are obvious number 3 for every every sequence a n is equal to 1 to infinity of l means of a of a we have n is equal to 1 to 
infinity a n belongs to a. Here we have just used the third property and just take its complement and by the theorem of de Moivre's, then the three will be proved. Okay. Four properties for every a1, a2, dot dot a n belongs to the collection set A, we have A1 union A2 union dot dot A n belongs to the collection A and A1 intersection A2 dot dot, dot intersection A n belongs to A. It is also similar to applications of Demovers theorems and finite and we can omit it the infinite infinite from n plus 1 to the infinite collections is taking as just phi then it will be obviously proved the property is 5 for every sequence a n n is equal to 1 to infinity of elements of collections A, we have that x belongs to x such that x belongs to A n for finitely many n belongs to the set of natural number belongs to the collection sets A. Example of sigma algebra. Let x be a non empty set. Prove that collection A is subset of x such that A or x minus A is at most countable. The collection A is a sigma algebra in X. We can prove it by the three properties. First one taking A is equal to phi Hence, phi belongs to the collections A. Second is obvious. Third is just taking A1, A2, A3, dot dot, dot A n. Then the collection will be will be at most countable. Current countable subset of union of countable is also countable. One of the another example which is not sigma algebra example let x is equal to n set of natural number is the family is equal to a subset of x a or x minus a is finite A sigma algebra in X. Not a sigma algebra, it's just if I have a problem of the property of the three. Thank you so much. This is the this is the details. Descriptions of the Sigma Yavra.